Well, technically today was our last day in Tokyo. We actually would have tomorrow in Tokyo as well, but we've decided that we want to go try and find Okigahara, which is the suicide forest. But we're not really sure how to get there, so we kind of have to improvise, but um, we'll see what happens. to what we were looking for, which is Mount Fuji. But uh, we're very close to Okigahara, which is the suicide forest. Right now we we're walking, we got off on a different stop. Um, we took like one of the sightseeing buses, got off on a different stop because there's a shrine out here that I really would like to see, which we are currently looking for. Maddie's using a Hello Kitty Polaroid camera and we're hanging out in a little cemetery that we found, which is very, very close to Mount Fuji, which uh, you can't see from where we're at. But um, I promise it's right over there. So yeah, we're gonna keep walking and uh, keep making some short little clips for you guys. So we're waiting on the bus to take us onward. The stop we got off on uh, wasn't exactly what I thought it was because when I pulled it up on Google, um, there was a, a picture of a quite cool shrine, and there are some, there are a few shrines and cemeteries up where we just were, which are pretty cool. But it wasn't what I was thinking it was. So uh, now we're just waiting for the bus. It's hot out <sighs> here. Yeah, it took a while to get here too. It took I think three, four trains, mm -hmm. and a couple now, hours. Now we're on a bus, waiting for a bus. He tried getting us on the wrong bus. We're just gonna keep waiting, and uh, the bus should be here soon. Yay. wandering around in this forest for about 20 minutes maybe and um thing is i feel like it's super probably super easy to get lost in here especially if you don't speak japanese because if you see all these signs are in japanese um so we just kind of been wandering around uh we've only seen a couple other people but um this forest is super cool i don't know if you can see but there's like just these sort of trails that go off in different directions and you know their trails are really the only even parts of this forest because if you see like it sort of goes down like there's like craters in the ground but apparently that's just from lava so uh yeah really really cool the forest is super quiet um i don't know i like it it's very serene so we're just gonna keep walking and uh yeah <laughs> So we've 
been walking for a little while longer and we got to a part of the path I guess that wasn't as well traveled. Oh fuck! Can you watch me? Is he coming? Well, that would be why. Um, we know that this road, this path, is a bit less traveled because of the volume of spider webs that are hanging across this path. Oh my god. You see that? We even found a spider that was fucking massive. Um, but yeah, so across these paths that you see here, there are just spider webs. And for some reason, these spiders, when you get close to them, they'll like fall from their webs. Um, they're still like attached to the web. <gasps> oh my God. Fuck. They're still like attached to the web, but they're like just falling um, a couple times and then they'll go back up and pretty much stay up. So we're walking back the other direction because I'm not really scared of dead bodies, which is a possibility to find out here, but I don't like spiders, so after seeing the granddaddy of all spiders back there, uh, which crawled up his web very angrily after seeing us, we're just walking back. So, um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Long ass train, and then we change the train, and then we have to do it again. Um, I've been back for almost a month at this point. There's absolutely no reason it should have taken me that long to make what you just saw. But with just trying to get back into the swing of things and also making a video out of hundreds of tiny clips and you're even working with like milliseconds in order to make, uh, you know, clips line with the song and it's just, uh, it's a pain, man. It's not exactly fun, so I didn't prioritize it. But I want to get back into making vinyl videos. I already have one filmed. I just got to edit it and put it up. Um, and I'd like to do those more often than I used to. Maddie and I are already planning our next trip, which is only a few months away, uh, December of this year, and it is currently the middle of August. A few months away, but um, we need those few months to sort of save money and um, plan because, you know, we, we came back from Japan literally fucking broke. Uh, it was an amazing trip, loads of fun. I will never forget it. And even the video, the one that you just saw is already edited and done. There's no video, picture, story, anything that can do any justice to how colorful and dramatic Japan is. Um, Tokyo specifically uh, is the craziest city I've ever seen. So I loved it and I, um, like to see what can outdo it so yeah uh, i'm gonna end this video as i normally do and uh that's with some pictures so hope you guys enjoyed and uh till next time